Hi guys, welcome back to the Edgewater Avenue YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to be making the Ray Top. For materials, you will need a half yard of swimwear fabric, rubber swimwear elastic, and you're going to need both quarter inch elastic as well as one inch, scissors or a rotary cutter, a seam ripper, a loop turner, an acrylic ruler, and the pattern for the Ray Top, which is available at edgewateravenue.com. So the first step is gonna be cutting your pieces. You're gonna cut two of the pattern piece. So I'm cutting one in the lining and one in the printed fabric. And then you're gonna cut three straps and the exact measurements for those straps are included inside the pattern. So now that we have all of our pieces, we can get started. So take your front pieces and match them with right sides together. You're gonna sew along the neckline, armholes, as well as the bottom line. You're also gonna attach elastic at this step. Then you're gonna sew each of the straps in half and you're not gonna be sewing elastic on right now. Now using your fingers or a loop turner, turn each of the straps to the right side. You're going to cut your one inch elastic to be the same size as the straps, and then you're gonna insert the elastic inside of each strap. After you've done this, I recommend sewing to attach the strap to the elastic. That way it doesn't slide around and you can focus on one thing at a time. So I just used a straight stitch for that. Next, you're gonna insert each strap into each strap opening. So for the longer shoulder straps, you'll put them inside the openings at the top of the top. And for the strap that goes across the back, you'll insert each side instead of each of the remaining openings. Pin down each of the straps and then sew across to secure. Now the last step is taking the top all the way to the right side. So to do this, you're gonna seam rip a hole as small as you can make it, but somewhere discreet and through that hole, you're gonna take everything to the right side. And now we need to attach the shoulder straps to the back strap. So mark the center of the back strap and put each of the shoulder straps on each side. Then using a straight stitch, you're gonna sew two stitches to secure the shoulder straps to the back strap. Finish off the hole we left earlier with an invisible stitch or a top stitch, and that completes the ray top. And here's how it turned out. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you're a fan of the ray top, please go to edgewateravenue.com to go check out the pattern. And be sure to check us out on Instagram, which is edgewateravee. And that's it for today. So thank you for stopping by, and I will see you in the next video.